Hello folks, um, we are here to just give a very simple explanation of what XPS is. XPS is Subcontracting and Partnership Exchange. Now, when we say subcontracting, we are looking at um, a contractor who has an obligation to a consumer or consumers and by virtue of the fact that whatever service or good that is providing to the consumer requires a lot of inputs and taking the fact that he may not be able to run around and source for all those inputs he then subcontracts that to um, a small enterprise uh, which we'll call a small and medium enterprise or an SME now that SME or those SMEs in this case um, would then feed the contractor with the key inputs that he wants to produce for the, con uh, for the consumer. Now, if for instance I am um, a contractor and I'm producing this, uh, we call Zobolo or more typically in Ghanaian context to say Sobolo. Now if this Zobolo I am a contractor and I'm producing for my consumers. This Zobolo that you see contains the hibiscus flour, hibiscus Zobolo. It contains sugar, it contains water, it contains other vital ingredients like ginger, others add all kinds of um, you know flavors and stuff to it. Now, for me as a contractor or uh, um, a major contractor my obligation is to produce this for the consumer now because of the various ingredients that this has and because of the fact that for instance if I need the hibiscus flour I would have to go around the whole country Ghana pick from say Tamale pick from Wenchi pick from other places I may not be able to do that so I subcontract that function to a subcontractor that we are calling SME. Now, let's say that for a very simple explanation of subcontracting, we just have about five key ingredients that is going into this. Uh, we have sugar, we have water, we have the hibiscus zobolo, we have ginger, and then we have some flavor, so five. Now, if each one of this would be supplied by an SME, then we are looking at five subcontractors feeding into my contract for me to be able to deliver this product, the hibiscus Zobolo, to my consumer. So now what happens then is that because I am so, so careful not to lose my consumers, I have certain standard requirements so the fact that you're supposed to supply me water does not mean that you can come and supply me with any kind of water I would require water of a certain standard in the same vein I would also require sugar of a certain standard I require ginger of a certain standard I require hibiscus zobolo of a certain standard and all these uh, that which would go into the making of this. So in subcontracting and partnership, very simple, it means that if I want to produce this and I'm a large scale contractor, I subcontract the various ingredients to the um, small and medium enterprise. And these small and medium enterprise will then feed me according to the requirements for me to be able to produce the Zobolo. That's the simple explanation of what uh, subcontracting is.